Nah, he's just like, nah, I want to show him my big head. You know what college I go to? I go to eSports college. Wow, he actually just hit him. He just <laughs> he actually... Just What's going on everyone? My name's Lauren and this is another Series E E Spotlight where we take a look at standout players and show you reasons why they're someone you want to watch out for over the course of Series E qualifiers. Donkey Kong doesn't sit very high on a lot of people's character tier lists, decent range, but they can struggle against zoners. And yet... For runes over there in Detroit, it doesn't look to be much of a problem. Donkey Kong can struggle against zoners, especially ones like Young Link, but last week in Series E qualifiers, runes was able to take out Blade and net 25 points. He did that through very two specific ways. One is his overall offensive play, but two, his edge guarding was insane. Let's take a look at the first clip, and I'll show you guys what I'm talking about. In this matchup, you have to be very specific about your offense, and Rune put on a master class in how to rack up damage against zoners. When he gets hit, he doesn't respond in a panic and he doesn't hard disengage. His game plan remains consistent, and notice how he doesn't overextend. He goes for base hits, singles, and doubles without leaving himself too compromised, and when the opportunity presents itself, he's able to come away with a stock. Crowding the space of a zoner and using your shield a lot are two ways to definitely establish a very strong neutral game, but there's another option entirely. You can just keep them off the stage. Let's take a look at another clip and I can show you how Runes was able to take top spot last week. Right out of the gate, Runes' MO is clear. Dash attacks and forward tilts to get Blade to the ledge and play from there. He's not overly aggressive and he's perfectly content to wait for the ledge option and go for the punish. This proved to be a reliable way to rack up damage on fresh stocks and set up kills later on. Runes played incredibly well last week, but it was no walk in the park. Not only did Grand Finals go all the way to last stocks game five, but Blade gave him quite a challenge in the Grand Finals reset as well. Blade showed why the entire region of Detroit, one of our newer regions, might be someone you want to watch out for. But who do you want to see next in the next E Spotlight? Let me know in the comments or on Twitter. But for now, my name's Lauren, and we'll catch you at the next E Spotlight. <laughs>